Hey everyone, this is a great video of Arden Zwelling from the Baseball Writers Association of America. Just giving a quick breakdown of the Hall of Fame vote. We draw these moral lines because of the character clause that is literally in the rules for the Hall of Fame, like in the description of the criteria, they'd say you have to judge this individual's character, which none of us in the BBWAA are qualified to do. But then we draw these moral lines so often on steroids when you've got a half dozen individuals on this ballot who have credible domestic violence allegations against them, when you have Kurt Schilling, who is, I mean, literally a seditionist. That's why if I was a voter, if I do become a voter in a couple of years, I don't think I'm going to think about the character clause. I'm just going to say, hey, what am I actually qualified to judge you on? What you did in the game, what kind of ball player you were, because I have statistics by which to measure that empirically and objectively. I really can't tell what kind of guy you were. And just think about this. In 2019, when they juiced the balls, Major League Baseball hit 16% more home runs than any year in the steroid era.